I made the biggest mistake you could do before a hockey game. I ate an all-you-can-eat sushi buffet. Half an hour ago, I finished. Wish me luck. Supposedly, we were playing a team that's always high scoring. They got one or two juniors on their team. Really good shooting, good movement, and uh, really good at deking. So let's see how we could do against them. All right guys, so on that goal there, this is gonna be a little bit more of a high level idea. But I think what I could have done is gone into the half butterfly. Like, so if I put my left leg down into a half butterfly, I could have stopped that from going in and then still had the opportunity to explode if I needed to, to my left, if he decided to bring it over. Yeah! Yeah! Oh. All right, so on that goal there, man, this guy, he could definitely shoot. The way he moved his stick at the last second there, I definitely thought he was going glove side. The only thing I could do maybe a little bit better is challenge him by stepping out of my crease a little bit further to take away more room for him to shoot at. Hi. Well, they weren't lying. These games against this team is always high scoring. Three minutes left in the first period and it's 3-2. Oh. Just keep shooting on that goalie, guys. Keep shooting on that goalie. Let's go. All right, welcome to second period action here where we have a two minute and 55 second penalty kill. I still feel like I am going to throw up all of my sushi dinner. Yeah! Ah! Oh, that camera's off for some reason. Yeah, he, he ran into a park goalie. It must be dead or something. Damn. Well, this one is still working, so uh, it might be like my old games. Shot, goal. Let me see it. Oh. Good game, man. Good game, guys. Good game, guys. Good game. Okay, we won 6-2 against a team that's usually really high scoring. So I'm glad I was able to shut them down as best as I could. And uh, yeah, hit that like button. Make sure to subscribe. I'll see you next game.